Hello, I'm Rokas Kirlis and I'd like to present a case for Intel Corporation, which is a world-leading semiconductor manufacturer mainly focusing on microprocessors that are found in most PCs and laptops today. Intel is a very innovative company with a strong commitment to introducing new technology every two years. This sounds very promising, however company analysis using home methodology tells a different story. Looking into the relative wealth chart of Intel Corporation, it is clear that the company is in the phase stage of corporate life cycle. Even though CFROI levels were pretty consistent, around 10% from year to year, Intel's cost of capital was increasing ever since company's peak CFROI spread and stock market performance in 1999, reducing returns up until 2008. Then things changed. However, it is important not to mistake increased CFROI levels with the beginning of a new cycle. It was merely caused by short-term asset growth due to Intel's extensive acquisition campaign during 2010 and 11, as well as increased sales due to a successful partnership with Apple Corporation. This resulted in peak profit margins and slightly better asset turns, which are both main drivers of CFROI. Despite the short-term growth, Intel is set to continue fading. However, what truly brings pessimistic outlook of the company's future is that market implied CFROI estimation is much lower than the Intel's default rate of fade, indicating possible underperformance. What's causing Intel to fade faster than its default rate is a shift in the computing industry trend. Rapid growth of smartphone and tablet market is eating away PC market share, which constitutes 66% of Intel's business segments. Intel missed the train of mobile device market, therefore will continue to lose its appeal to investors which is already evident by current 88% stock under elevation. Summing all up, Intel appears to be a healthy company. It has nearly perfect credit rating, low leverage, heavy R&D and innovation. Therefore, it's a good company to look into for short-term speculation as it often tends to present earning surprises. However, due to changing industry and natural fade, Intel is expected to underperform in long run with CFROI levels falling to only 5% within the next 5 years. So portfolio managers should consider selling the stock. Thank you.